First off, you are going to want to get in between the tower and the building. Once you are there, look for the door shown here in the video. This is your start point for the climb. Start climbing straight up until you cannot climb anymore. You should be at a peak of sorts above the door. At this point, you are going to need to get to the corner of the building on your left side. Do this by shimmying along the wall horizontally to the corner. Once there, you should be able to climb up the rest of the way to the top of the balcony. Once on the balcony, you are going to want to turn and face the tower. You will notice a graded window in the center of the wall. This is where you will jump to start your ascent. Go straight up until you hit double stripes on the wall. From here, you will shimmy to your left until you are around the corner and on the other side under a rectangular block. At this point, you will scale the wall to the open window and enter the tower. After your entrance into the tower, you are going to continue the climb from the inside. Start scaling the wall that the treasure chest is sitting against. Take a path up the wall that resembles somewhat of a warped straight line. And by that I mean you want to stay in the center half of the wall, going left and right all the way to the top. Once on top, you will look for the viewpoint and walk out onto it. After you are out there, it would be best if you synchronize before you jump. Otherwise, you will have to make the climb a second time to get your viewpoint. Next, you want to do a leap of faith by holding down your right trigger and A button. And then pushing forward on your left thumbstick. This should send you on a dive downwards to the high dive achievement.